Hello guys, my name is Bob. In this video, I will be showing you the solution to the integration of XQ e to the power x dx. Before I do so, if you guys like the solution, help me press the thumbs up icon below this video. So to bring this video up onto the top of the search and more people will get access to this video. For this particular question, we will be applying the technique called integration by parts. The integration by parts technique tells us that within these two terms, if I were to let one of the term as u and the other term as dv, this gives us uv subtracting away the integral of v du, in which to find my du, I will simply differentiate u, and to find my v, I will integrate dv. In this particular case, I will let u be equals to x cubed, and then my dv be equals to e to the power x dx. To find what is my du, I differentiate u with respect to x. This gives me 3x squared, in which multiplying both sides by dx, I will get du is equal to 3x squared dx. To find my v, I integrate dv, which is the integral of e to the power x dx, I will get e to the power of x. I found my u, dv, v, and du. I can apply this integration by parts formula to move on to the next step. So I will get as follows, my u is x cubed, my v is e to the power of x, subtracting away the integral of v, which is e to the power of x, times du is 3x squared dx. And I simplify it in such a manner. Then I work out the integration by parts for the integration of x squared e to the power of x. So I let u be equals to x squared and my dv be equals to e to the power x dx. So to find my du, I take u respect to x, I get 2x, in which multiplying both sides by dx, I get du is equals to 2x dx. My v is the integral of e to the power x dx, which is e to the power x. I apply the integration by parts formula to move on to the next step. I get the following, which is I'll first copy the first term. And then as for the second term, I will apply the integration by parts formula. My u is x squared, and then my v is e to the power of x, subtracting away the integral of v, which is e to the power of x, my du is 2x dx. Then I simplify the whole problems, I will get something like this. I then proceed on to do the integration by parts technique for the third time, focusing on the integral of x e to the power of x. I let u be equals to x, and my dv is e to the power of x dx. So my du is equals to dx, my v is the integral e to the power x dx, which gives me just e to the power x. Once I have all this, then I can proceed on to the next step. So the next step, I will apply the integration by parts technique for the integral of x e to the power x dx. What I get is as follows, my u is x, my v is e to the power x, subtracting away the integral of v du is just dx. And I will simplify the equation. I'll get the following. And the last step, I'll just evaluate the integral of e to the power of x. It's basically just e to the power of x. What I will do next, I will factorize the e to the power of x out of the equation. I get my final answer, which is e to the power of x, square bracket, x cubed, subtracting away 3x squared plus 6x minus 6 plus c. And this will be the final answer to the integration of x cubed e to the power of x dx. If you guys like the solution, help me press the thumbs up icon below this video and do consider to subscribe for daily integration problems. My name is Bob. Thank you for your support and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye guys.